Hi, it's Kyle from Bytewing Games, and today we're taking a look at The Fog, Escape from Paradise. In The Fog, your objective is to escape from the fog, rescuing islanders by bringing them onto boats. After setup, players will take turns drafting which islanders they are going to attempt to save. Simply take your colored disc and place it underneath an islander to designate it as your own. After all islanders have been claimed, players will take turns according to the turn tracker. On your turn, you will move islanders towards the ships. And that's your whole turn! Follow the turn tracker, taking turns in a specified order, and moving the fog further along when indicated. When the fog reaches the shoreline, the game ends. You will score points for saving islanders early. You will also score for having islanders in their proper place on their nation's boat. For example, green islanders want to be on the green boat. You will lose points for losing islanders to the fog. The further back they are lost, the more points you lose. So I don't always love games with a lot of movement, mostly because I remember the days of trouble or shoots and ladders where I just can't roll the right number, and man is that frustrating. The fog doesn't rely on straight luck or a roll of the die. Instead, you have seven movement points per turn. You can move in different ways, each taking a number of different movement points to move. So I could move to an open space, costing one movement point, you can also jump over other characters, slide between characters, swap places, and more, each costing multiple movement points. You can't land on the same space as another islander, and with the constant threat of the encroaching fog, it can be a challenge to get all of your islanders to the beach and onto the boat. And once you do reach the boat, do you try to get that islander in their perfect location? Even if that means risking another islander to the fog? Where this game shines is in the tantalizing decisions. I could score big points early by getting this islander on the correct spot on their nation's boat. But am I leaving an islander in the back at the mercy of the encroaching fog? And do you sacrifice that one islander so you can score those big points? The ability or inability to move all the way across the island is what makes this game so frustrating in all the right ways. Can you find a way to sneak through the crowd? And if you set yourself up to move on the next turn, will another player steal that opening you created? Probably. The limited space is what creates that tight player interaction, which is the number one thing that I'm looking for in games. All in all, I really enjoyed the fog. Each turn I simply moved my pieces, but how and when to move them created fascinating decisions. And with each islander having a unique type of movement they specialize in, there were plenty of things to think about while my opponents took their turn. This game should be live on Kickstarter as of August 2022. If this sounds at all interesting to you, go ahead and check it out. I have a link in the description below. If you have any questions, let me know. Until next time.